Hello, this is Goku for someone, and I'm back with my top 10 TV show heroes. Me and BK Critic are doing this together. Now, anybody is welcome to join in, but there are a couple of rules. The rules are as followed. First rule is anybody syndicated on television does count. It does not have to be syndicated in the U.S. Anime live action cartoon all qualified for me only i'm only doing live action characters next rule is you cannot have duplicate characters even if they have more than one show meaning that you cannot have uh five or ten batman just can't do it the next rule is you cannot have two people from the exact same show or two people from the same universes. Now I'm fixing, I'm fixing this problem by actually having, uh, by actually having honorable mentions when people from different universes kind of collide, and I have one for today too. And then the final rule is if the character significantly changes throughout the show, you have to name what version you like. So now the rules are the way. My number ten was Michael Weston from Burn Notice. My number 9 was Eli from Stargate Universe. My number 8 was Chuck from the TV show Chuck. My number 7 was Fox Mulder from the X-Files. And my number 6 was Starbuck from the new Battlestar Galactica TV show. Number 5 is Buffy from the TV show Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Number four is Dean from Supernatural. The, now we're at the nitty gritty. We're at the very last two. And my list got an overhaul recently. You're not going to know what it is till next week. My number one changed. Weirdly enough, yes, my number one changed. The other one will be uh, an honorable mention. This week, I don't really have one. No, I don't. This week... Throughout the whole thing, my opening has always been the logo from Heroes. And initially, I wasn't going to have a character from Heroes. But then I realized, yes, one of the greatest TV show characters is Peter Petrelli from Heroes. My friend doesn't really like him because he thinks he has a lame power. Um, lame meaning that it's not an interesting power. It's not, like, interesting and... Okay. It's too powerful of a power, so that makes it uninteresting. You could have a character who, a comic book uh, hero who's a god, who can't be killed, who can't be hurt, who can't be maimed, and nothing can happen to him. Wouldn't be a very, very interesting character because there's no dilemma there. Unless you write a story involving him that's interesting and has plot twists and all that, that would not be a very interesting character. But Peter Petrelli as a character is very interesting, and he had a lot of evolution. And in season four, he actually gets really, he gets much better because... They had this thing with him. Give him a power. Or uh, basically the first season. He finds out that he can fly. But then soon he finds out he can't really fly. He has the ability to emulate power. Or he has the ability. Anybody he sees with a, with, with a power. Um, if he thinks of them. He can use that power. And so by the end of the season. He becomes godfully powerful. Because he can use all their powers. So season 2. He gets amnesia. Okay, so by the end of this season, he remembers everything and he becomes godly powerful. So in season three, he loses his power. Okay, by the end of the season, he gains his power back. And um, in season, uh, but now he has the power that he can only keep one power at a time. And from there, his power became more stable. And in season four, he used it in a very interesting way. And I like the evolution of the character. I like the fact that he's a uh, that he's a nurse and he wants to be a nurse and that his family's politicians and they don't understand his uh, understand who he is and I really like his character I think he was a great and he was essentially the main character hero was also very cool but he was Peter Petrelli was the coolest character on this show and I just loved his character and who he was in the show and that's why he made 
number two. Now this was Goku 4071. The information is at the beginning of the video. Anybody can join in. The list is almost done. If you do join in, just wait for next next Friday and just do your top ten. There's no need for you to do uh, two videos right now. See you next time, YouTube. YouTube. No. This was Goku 4071, and I'll see you next time.